So guys and girls, welcome back to another video. Now today is more of a chilled video. Today is actually my overdue Q&A. So I'm going to be answering your questions. So let's get to it. Okay, cool. So basically I asked you guys on Snapchat, it was such short notice, but some of you guys actually sent in some questions. So let's just answer it. Hey Hamza, my question for you is where do you see yourself in three years? Also love your videos, keep them coming. That's actually a really hard question, but like just off the top of my head, I want to be on 100,000 subscribers. That is definitely the main goal. Um, number two is a developed social media marketing agency where I've got loads of clients signed. Yeah, that's number two. And number three is probably just developing everything else that I have going on. So yeah, and also I just want to be able to do what I love. So I want to continue making videos and just do what I want to do. Have you ever seriously injured your back or snapped something or hurt yourself while you're on your travel? As a matter of fact, I have. I've literally had so many injuries while doing um, like gymnastics and stuff because I actually, if you guys didn't know, I used to do gymnastics. Like I trained four times a week and I was training for Great Britain. So yeah, I, I got injured loads. Literally, I cracked my head, head open like twice. Um, I don't know why I'm laughing, but like I cracked my head open. Um, I literally lacerated my leg. That was like nasty. I actually got that on film. I'm not going to show you, but I might show you in another vid, but it would probably get age restricted if I did show you. So yeah, I've had like so many injuries, like a pulled hamstring. Yeah, it, the list goes on. Trust me, if you want a sport that's safe, just don't do gymnastics. Yeah, that's pretty much my advice. Hey, Hamza. I'm a big fan of yours. I love your videos. So my question for you is, who are your top five favorite YouTubers? My top five favorite YouTubers, oh, this is actually quite hard. So my top five favorite YouTubers, one of them is definitely Mr. Who's the Boss. He is such a super chill guy. I've actually met up with him at EGX. It was so crazy. Like we got to check out some games and then we actually like, um, they were throwing t-shirts in the air and we literally just like murked the whole of it. I don't know, it was pretty cool. So Mr. Who's the Boss, definitely. Um, then we have, I don't know, let me think. Um, Korea Tyler, Gary Vaynerchuk. I've been following this guy for like over a year now because he's more of like an entrepreneur but now he's getting into the YouTube game. So that's three. Number four would probably be um, Calyx, and then number five, maybe Rice Gum. I don't know. Okay, so now I'm actually gonna get onto the video questions which you guys sent me on YouTube. So pretty much the first one is, where do you earn your money? So I actually have different ways that I actually earn my money. One of them is obviously YouTube ad revenue, YouTube sponsorships, affiliates. Um, so that's from Amazon affiliates and other affiliate programs. Um, number four is the website I work for, the YouTube channel as well. And um, number five is I sell drugs. I'm joking, I, I don't do that, trust me. I, I don't, I'm a nice guy. Okay, so the next question is from Sahal and he says, how do you get products to review? Well, it's actually quite simple. So when you start out, it's very, very easy to actually get products to review. Now, I'm not gonna like, I'm not gonna say it's simple, anyone can get it. You have to actually work hard. I'd say you have to get minimum like three, 400 subs, but there's no real limit in my opinion. And then what, I, what you have to do, this is a tip, make sure you like note this down for if you are starting out on YouTube, you have to basically, provide them value so you have, you have to convince them as to why you are helping them so maybe you're helping them gain sales exposure for me that's my main two points and i actually drive them a lot of traffic to their site so that's what i can say to companies if i do approach them then when you get a bit bigger you'll see that loads and loads of different companies approach you on a daily basis to review their products for sponsored videos and it just opens up a whole lot of opportunities so you have to kind of climb the ladder up so what i'm saying is if you put in the work now it will definitely pay off just email as many companies as you can and and just basically ask them, well not ask them, tell them why you can help their brand. So yeah, that's my two cents. Next up is another question. Um, would you rather die or commit suicide? And if you went back in time and could take three things, what would they be? Would I rather die or commit suicide? That's just a stupid question. Um, yeah, I definitely wanna die instead of committing suicide because that's the logical answer. Um, yeah, and, uh, and to answer your other question, um, I could take three things, what would they be? I'd take a phone, I'd take a camera, and I'd probably take my PC. The last question is from Ali Kazamatsu. He says, do you even lift? Well, I mean, you lift. I mean, you were in my previous football vid and I mean, your biceps just got into the way of the lens. So yeah, I don't know. But like that question, man, I'm done. Anyway guys, that wraps it up for today's video. If you did enjoy this Q&A and you do want more, make sure to leave a like on today's video. That would be amazing. And also add me on Snapchat right here so you don't miss out on any more vids. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Comment down below, hashtag, um, do you even lift if you watch this far into the video? And yeah, that's about it for today's video. Anyway guys, I'm Hamza from Super Extreme Video and I'll talk to you up in the next one. Latest lads, bye. And we've been working.
So if you hating hard, it's the last you can fall back. Yeah, yeah, I swear I'm in myself.